Now that's interesting. Come on, let's go somewhere else. Are you kidding? It's like a car crash. I can't look away. That worried about him when he was gone. Oh, <laughs> Who's Charlie talking to? Don't know. Never seen him before. Well, she seems to be having a very good time. That makes for a change. Oh, come on. She hasn't been that bad. Yeah, all right. Maybe you're right. Maybe she does need to go out there and have some fun. You think Charlie needs to get some action, don't you? I said fun. No, but it's true. Think about it. Her love life's been pretty much non-existent since Angela. I mean, Colleen's getting more than she is. Oh, please, never say that again. Well, it's true. You know what? Maybe if she got back out there, she might get off my back. What do you think? <laughs> oh, I'm staying out of this. Oh, can I have that for one sec? What are you doing? Trust. Trust. Well, you and I seem to be talking up quite an appetite, eh? Uh, Rubes, we didn't order this. Yeah, well, Leah just saw how hard you were working, thought you might need a little bit of sustenance. I'm Ruby, by the way, Charlie's daughter. Hi. Uh, Ruby, this is Michael. He's down from Area Command for the day. We're talking about work. Ah, oh, right. So you're a cop as well. It's fantastic. Charlie loves her job. You guys must have so much in common. Hey, you need to go now. Right. She's using a scary cop voice. Don't worry, you learn to love that. So good to meet you, Michael. Pleasure. Yeah, enjoy this mm. cake. Oh, hey. Hey, that, what are you doing? Charlie, you know how you said you'd love a relationship if only you could find the right one? Why? Well, I've made a list of potentials. I think you'd be surprised how many I found. And I've made a short list of the best ones. And I think you should start with Brian. No, no, I'm not, I'm not starting with anyone, Ruby. I told you, no matchmaking. What? That's my picture, OK? What are you thinking? This is my private life. And I, I don't want weird men leering at my picture and sending me kisses. You got a lot of kisses. You actually made the top 100. And if you want, I could put you on Woman Seeks Woman, W Chances. No, no, I want you to get rid of it now. Right, but Charlie, it's a really, really good website. And it says that 70% of the time it works every single time. Leah, Leah thought they were hot. Did you know about it? No, 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 no. The first I found out about it is when I got home. But I did think some had potential. Yeah, and Charlie, you're not getting any younger. Do you really want to be known as the sad old spinster cop forever? What? Who calls me that? No one yet, but they will. They will. Now, I've done all the legwork, all right? I've sorted through the nutmags. Just have a look. I quite liked Craig. Yeah, and Ryan, he has the same favourite <laughs> movie as you. Everyone likes that movie. But he's hot, too. Yeah. Yeah, the picture's probably ten years old. I do like the bit about being dubious about internet dating. At least he's honest. Hmm. What do you say? You will have fun, Charlie, I promise. And if you don't, I will not interfere anymore. No, that's what you said last time. Just one date. Come on, it can't hurt. <sighs> Fine. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my God. You scared me. Oh, my gosh. The walk of shame? No. Yeah. Did you or did you not go out on a date tonight? Yes. But there was no chemistry. <laughs> OK, yeah, well, your lipstick says otherwise smudgy. Oh, give me a break. I hardly know the guy. Yeah, well, you definitely bashed someone. And if it wasn't Ryan, I want to know who it is. OK, we made out. But that doesn't make it all right to hook up on a first date. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Insert let you here. Well done, Mother. Now, will there be a replay? Yes. I think it's safe to say there could be a number of replays. That's still cheating. Even in pretend lesbian land, or wherever it is you are living at the moment. OK, you are out of line. It meant nothing. Ruby! Nicole! Because I know you're going to cave eventually. Oh, I will, will I? Yes, you will, because you are a loving, supportive mother who doesn't want her darling daughter to be a social misfit her whole life on her L plate. I'm not convinced it'd be safe. 
Charlie, I'm so safe. I am super safe. Ask Leah or Irene. They've driven with me. Well, can't they just keep driving you? Okay, we've been over this. Leah is going to Africa. Irene is taking her shifts at the diner, and Charlie has the day off. Yeah, I have the day off to pack. And as much as I love helping you to pack, I'm not doing it by myself. Yeah, that's totally fine. You know, we could just go for, like, an hour, and then 14 more hours by the end of the week, and then I can get my piece. I'm serious, Rubes. Driving with me is only going to end in tears. I'm sure you're just overreacting, Charlie. No, I'm really not. We would just get on each other's nerves, and we definitely wouldn't speak to each other for at least weeks afterwards. In fact, Rubes, I really think you should just do your last few lessons with a proper driving instructor. Okay, you just really need to relax. It was with all the stress. Okay. When Dad taught me to drive, it was hell. He was unbearable, and so was I. I'm surprised he didn't pull his gun on me. Ah, uh, okay, maybe you should leave your gun at home when you take Ruby. You are taking this way too seriously. I am a safe driver, Charlie. I am. What's it going to take for me to prove it to you? Recite the road rules by heart? Yes, that would be a great start. Oh. If there are no lanes marked on the road, you should drive. Nearest to the left-hand side of the road. Next. On exiting a roundabout, do you indicate left or right? You indicate left, of course. Come on, give me a hug yeah, on. Okay. Um, how close can you park to another vehicle when parked parallel to the curb? Wow, I didn't even know. You that. must leave at least one meter front and back. Are you hearing this, Charlie? Yes. I told you I knew my road rules. Ruby, did you memorize the whole entire manual? Because it's kind of a great game. Yeah, I did. So can we go driving now? Uh, yeah, maybe in about five or ten years. Charlie, you promised. You said if I could prove to you that I knew my road rules, you would take me out. Uh, no, I don't remember saying that exactly. Oh. Uh, I might go. <clears throat> oh, thanks, Nick. I'm so sorry. I know you've got a lot going on at the moment. <laughs> no, it's a good distraction from what's going on at home. So. Oh, how was the funeral? I'm so sorry. I forgot to ask you. Oh, no, it was fine. It's, yeah, it's pretty heavy at home, but it's OK. Yeah, how's Marilyn? Yeah, she... She has Sib with her, so that's good. But, you know, it's hard for her. Anyway, I'm going to go, but good luck with the driving. Thanks, Nick. See ya. Bye. All right. We're going. Mm-hmm. Where? Driving. I'm going to show you there's nothing to worry about, and the sooner we get it over and done with Charlie, the better. Ruby, I drive a manual car. Well, surely it can't be that different from an auto. It is. Well, it would be good for me to learn on both. Come on, you're not getting out of it. Soon we get over and done with the better. You're not getting out of it. Come on. Hello. Charlie! Get 